Hey everybody, get ready for some spooky and supernatural stuff in this episode. Let's do this! But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and turn on notifications to receive our new videos. Usually, trail cams are set up to record the unique wildlife in a certain area. But, as you can see, we've captured something else. And as much as I'd like to tell you it's all just a coincidence, it's not. This camera was set up in a remote region near a river because people were reportedly disappearing around there. Some people thought maybe ghosts were causing the disappearances, while others said it was just a weird coincidence. But, seriously, after watching this video, I think we can all agree that those strange creatures are definitely involved in those disappearances. What do you guys think those weird creatures are? Some suggest they might be spirits of the river punishing the people for a misdeed. Others suggest it's nothing more than a couple of guys in a costume making fun of the townspeople. Usually, I'm tempted to pick the other side of the argument, but a closer look at the clip will show you that eyes reflect the light in the environment. Those eyes are definitely not human-sized, so I'm wondering if we're dealing with paranormal beings. I'm not sure why they showed up, or if they're connected to the disappearances in the area. What are your thoughts on this? Have you ever been out for a drive and spotted some weird things? Did they look anything like this? The individual who posted the video said they were out for a drive with their family when they saw a weird object in the sky. The more they looked, the more they were convinced it had to be some kind of being looking down from above. As you can see, it looks like some kind of creature, kind of like a humanoid, animalistic creature. Think of a goat with a human body, but then again, it could just be pareidolia, seeing what you want to see. Some think the image was superimposed onto the clip, which is a basic term, meaning it's fake. Some individuals who commented on the original post thought it was some sort of projection in the sky. This video was circulating online of a baby with fur and facial features resembling a lion cub. It received a lot of attention and sparked various reactions. Some people even humorously suggested that the baby's resemblance may have been due to the mother having an affair with a dog man or a dog. I know it might sound weird and gross, but when it comes to these creepy events, you can't rule anything out. Some people even thought it could be some kind of genetic mutation or weird thing. I'm not an expert, but it really looks like a silicone doll. And you know how those dolls have been everywhere, especially in movies. Also, the background noise makes it seem like it's probably part of an exhibition. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. The ocean still holds so many secrets for us, even though we've been studying our planet for a long time. Check out this footage, taken by a deep-sea camera. As you can see, a glowing creature swimming in the water that looks like a jellyfish, but it's totally different. Instead of tentacles, it has these four arm-like things on top of its body that help it move around. Scientists are freaking out about this discovery. It's not like a regular jellyfish, and scientists haven't figured out what it is yet. It's one of many mysteries that the ocean has in store. The ocean is so big and full of surprises that it keeps scientists interested and on their toes. When they find something like this glowing creature, it's a reminder of how much we still don't know about the deep ocean. Some dudes were out in the woods feeding a bear and took this footage. No, 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 no. Huh? <laughs> so, there's this person in the car shooting the video, 
and there's someone outside with a bag of snacks or food feeding the bear. We don't really know what's going on in the video or whether the bear is friendly or not, but watch what happens next. As the bear gets closer to the person feeding it, something totally unexpected goes down. The man was taken by surprise when the bear suddenly charged at him, letting out a loud growl. But quick on his feet, the man yelled in response, startling the bear and causing it to run back into the woods. It was a close call and a good reminder that even if a bear seems calm and friendly, approaching it as if it were a pet is never a good idea. No, 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 no. Huh? At night, a guy gets woken up by a weird tapping on his front door. Feeling curious and a bit freaked out, he decides to investigate while recording everything on his phone. As he gets closer to the door, he sees a strange, short figure tapping on the glass. When he looks through the glass, he sees that the figure has a face. So, the guy opens the door, and suddenly, this weird creature just disappears into thin air. Obviously, the guy is totally freaked out by this whole thing. Some people think there's some kind of ghost or spirit haunting the house. But then there are others who are like, Nah, it's all a big setup. Whether you believe in all that spooky stuff or you think it's just a well-planned prank, the video is seriously creepy and makes you wonder what's really going on. What's your take on it? Haunted house or just a clever trick? A dad had just tucked his daughter into bed and put up a camera in her room to keep an eye on her. Later that night, he heard weird noises coming from her room and got worried. He quickly checked the monitor to see if she was okay, and what he saw completely terrified him. On the screen, his daughter was in bed, not moving at all, with her eyes wide open and shining in the dark. What made it even creepier was that she was staring right into the camera. The camera had been hidden carefully, so there was no way she could have known where it was. She was staring at it without blinking. It was so creepy and weird that the man couldn't move because he was so scared. Can you imagine looking at your child, thinking they're peacefully sleeping, but instead seeing something this horrifying? I mean, just take a look at this. How can anyone explain something so terrifying? My grandmother once told me about rare cases where people, especially kids, sleep with their eyes open like deer. They say, he is sleeping like a deer. So interesting, right? Regarding the eyes, their brightness is a result of the night vision camera, which causes a reflection. Take a look at this and tell me how this is even possible. This person came home to their apartment and found these tiny black things stuck in the walls. At first, it looked like they might be birds or bugs. But then, when you zoom in with the camera, you see that they're spikes that are usually put on fences to keep people from climbing over. It's pretty bizarre, right? It's really weird because when you check out the fence around the building, you can see that a bunch of those spikes are missing. Instead, they're stuck in the concrete walls of the building. It's like they've been driven really deep into the solid wall as if they've been launched or pushed with a crazy amount of force. I can't wrap my head around this. Can you believe someone went to all the trouble to stick those spikes into the wall? It must have taken a lot of time and effort, and they seem pretty stuck in there. 
Maybe there's some kind of weird magnetic force at play, or some unknown energy that caused the spikes to come loose from the fence and embed themselves into the building. Or maybe it was a crazy strong windstorm or some other natural force that somehow carried the spikes from the fence. Just keep in mind that at some point, someone might show up and say that this is actually a part of an artwork created by a certain artist. I'm leaving the decision up to you. If you're scared of spiders, you might want to skip ahead two minutes. So, there's this person who comes home one day and sees something pretty weird. There's this huge spider just chilling in the corner where the wall meets the ceiling like it owns the place. Its legs are all long and thin, reaching across the wall, making it look even bigger than it is. The spider was huge and looked like it was keeping an eye on everything from its high perch. For anyone scared of spiders, this would be a total nightmare. And even if you're not that afraid, the size of this thing is enough to creep anyone out. The homeowner probably needed some guts to decide what to do next, whether to try and get rid of it or just leave it be and hope it doesn't move too much. This video from a hospital shows doctors and nurses working hard to revive a patient when something unbelievable happens. As you watch the video, you'll see the patient lying on the bed with the medical team working hard. But what's really strange is what looks like a ghostly figure rising up from the patient and floating above the bed before vanishing. The creepiest part is that none of the medical staff seem to notice the ghostly figure next to the patient. They just carry on with their work as if everything is normal. It's only when they watch the video later that they freak out at the sight. The appearance of the figure adds an eerie vibe to an already tense and emotional situation. What do you think? Did the patient's soul leave their body? Or is there any other explanation for this spooky sighting? This guy is holding a super realistic silicon mask, but if you look closely, he's wearing one too. Silicon face masks have become so lifelike that they're starting to raise some serious concerns. Just picture someone walking around with a mask of your face, fitting in perfectly as if they were you. These masks are no longer just for fun or dressing up. They now pose a real threat to privacy and security. This mask looks shiny and impressive, even if it's not as natural looking as some others. The level of detail and craftsmanship that goes into making these masks can make them almost look like real skin. What's even more unsettling is that these masks are widely available for purchase. With such realistic masks on the market, there's a big potential for misuse. It's not just about having fun or playing a prank anymore. It's about the scary possibility that someone could use these masks for bad stuff. Am I overreacting? Or should we actually be concerned? There was this Swedish YouTuber, Ellen. She was out in the woods filming for her true crime channel one night. And then, boom, she caught something super weird on camera. This creature with a tiny head and glowing eyes just popped up out of nowhere. This creature popped out from behind this massive tree and then just disappeared. It freaked Ellen out, and honestly, I don't blame her. This thing didn't look human at all. It didn't even resemble any animal I've ever seen, except for its glowing eyes. People were saying it might be some kind of night creature, but come on, I've never seen an animal with long hair like that, unless it's a lion or a horse with a mane. So this thing totally didn't look like either of them. What do you think it could have been? Lately, it's all about aliens, right? People claim they've seen some extraterrestrial beings all over the place. Check out this video. Grave diggers are doing their thing, digging up a grave thinking they'll find something valuable. But guess what they find instead? A tall gray alien wide awake and staring right at them. And here's the crazy part. The alien starts moving. Now I'm left wondering, 
How long has this extraterrestrial been catching some Zs in the grave? And what on earth could explain its sudden awakening? The home security camera caught this creepy video that freaked out the homeowner. In the video, the homeowner gets into her car to look for a lighter. But little does she know. Something spooky is about to happen. A ghostly figure suddenly appears near the building, casually walks across the camera's view, and then disappears into the bushes on the other side. It's seriously spooky. The homeowner didn't see anything unusual. But her dogs were acting strange. One of them even chased after something that looked like a ghost until it disappeared. What do you think? Was it a ghost or just a trick of the light? I'm going back to 1996 in Brazil. The story goes that the Brazilian army shot down a UFO and it crashed in Varginha, Brazil. When the military went to check it out, they found this creature. It's a weird looking one, almost like a reptile, and it's about seven to eight feet tall, lurking around in the woods. The soldiers caught the mysterious being, but what happened afterward or where it was taken remains a mystery. Do you think it was a real encounter with an alien? Or is someone trying to trick us? Have you ever wondered if ghosts are friendly? Check this out. Just imagine. This woman was doing the dishes when suddenly, all the cupboards in the room swung open and the bowl she was using slid across the sink. It all happened so quickly that she was totally shocked and barely had time to react. Thankfully, she wasn't hurt. But sometimes in situations like this, people can get seriously injured. Some people say that some ghosts can turn violent because they had bad experiences when they were alive. These kinds of ghosts are called polar GE. They're known for expressing their ghostly tantrums in physical ways. That's when you start seeing objects flying around, hearing strange noises, and the weirdest of all, a fireplace lighting up on its own. Do you think this is one of them? A creature was caught on a trail cam in the woods. It was peeking from behind a tree with light fur, small, dark eyes, a nose similar to a human's but smaller, and tiny lips. The person who recorded it thinks it's a smaller version of a Sasquatch. It could be a baby Bigfoot or a small one. Humans come in all kinds of shapes and sizes, so who knows? Some people in the spooky stuff community say it's the best Bigfoot video in a while, but others say it's obviously fake. From my perspective, it looks like a monkey with a funny mustache. What do you think? Is it real or a hoax? That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share your thoughts in the comments.